Hey guys, I'm here to do a flip through of this fun floral sticker book by Happy Planner. So I'm gonna go ahead and put one to the side and do a flip through of one for you because they are the same exact thing. So this is what the cover looks like. And then you flip and you get to this page of beautiful florals and they do have some gold foil in them. Guys, this whole book is absolutely beautiful. And then we have some smaller ones. These don't have gold foil, so these are just regular. And I like that they have corner stickers here. So you don't have to use a regular sticker. So like this one, for instance, if you were to put it on the corner, you'd have something hanging off and you'd have to cut it off. So I love that they incorporated these. You don't have to cut anything. You just put it to the corner and you're good to go. Then we have some more um, of the exact same florals with gold as well. Another thing that I love about this uh, sticker book is that they have these long floral banners. I guess you would call them different florals, of course. I love these. Um, you could use them in place of washi. You could use them um, to maybe highlight an event or a birthday. Maybe if you're doing a spread that has uh, colorful boxes, just plain colorful boxes. You can use these stickers to highlight maybe around the entire colorful box or the top and the bottom, you know, however you want to. But these I think would be great for that purpose. And we have this one down here again, beautiful with just different shades of pink, so darks and lights. And then we have this page again with the gold floor, um, foil florals I'm sorry they're gorgeous they're fun they're vibrant and you could use it for absolutely any occasion whatever occasion you want um, wherever you want in your planner however you want to use them you could use them and then flipping the page we have just the same exact thing so just the same exact page so you get two of those. And then we have these florals, which I love. I think these are kind of watercolory. I want to say only because of how they look. So there's, it looks like a mixture of colors. So there's some darks, there's some medium, some lights. They are gorgeous nonetheless. Flipping. We have the same florals, just smaller. And again, we have those beautiful floral banners. So we have the longer ones and the shorter ones here. And then we have these florals. So these florals, I think, are the more realistic kind of florals because they do look like real um flowers so i think that's where these would come in if you wanted to do kind of a more realistic uh floral spread they are still very beautiful though and then we have some more here Again, these beautiful floral banners, you guys. These are, of course, bigger, way bigger. And then we have another page of the realistic flowers. These are just smaller. Of course, this one's my favorite. And then we have the pastel, these are rose gold foil. I'm not sure if you guys can see that. And they're pastel, they are beautiful. Especially this yellow. I absolutely love yellow, so of course anything with yellow, I'm 
absolutely 100% down for. And then we have another page, so it's the exact same page of the florals. And then we have these florals. Now, I love these florals because they're really islandy, um, kind of like Hawaiian-ish. I think these would be great for like a summer uh, spread. So maybe if you want to do flamingos with these flowers would be great. Kind of any uh, summery animal, maybe like a water animal even. I think I want to do a, f a flamingo spread and I think I'm going to incorporate these flowers into that spread because they're just gorgeous. And then we have some, again, islandy um, leaves. And I believe these leaves were in one of the student sticker books, but it was an older student sticker book. If you guys know the name of that sticker book, leave it down below. On the next page, we have these florals again, beautiful floral banners here. And this sticker does say, this is the good life. And then we have a big ant symbol here. Beautiful floral wreath. I love these because again, if you wanna highlight a birthday or an event, place this down and right in the center of it. And then we flip the page and we have some more flower wreaths. And then we have this sticker that says, She saw beauty in everything. And then these florals, if I'm not mistaken, are in one of those little half uh, sticker books. But I know it is in one of them. And then this one I like because you can take um, maybe some fine tip Sharpies and fill this in however you want to and make it customizable. Or you could just leave it black and white if you wanted to. So then moving on we have these florals. simple, really pretty. And then I believe these are supposed to be cherry blossoms. I'm not exactly sure, don't quote me. But they still are very beautiful. And then we just have some more of these florals. These florals, they're just smaller versions. Two different ones. 
one of them had a little bunny on the on the cover and you know those kids come with washies and those things so that bunny one did have the matching washies to this uh, floral so here they are and they're the exact same wa uh, florals that are in this book and I'm so excited to do a spread because I have been wanting these florals forever so that I can use this washi and this washi and do a spread and now I can finally do the spread that I want to do because I have the florals and I have the washi so I'm really excited about that so make sure you're on the lookout for that video and then turning the page we have these which have lots of gold foil in them Floral. Some are just bigger, some are smaller. And then we have these florals. Now I do have a student planner that matches these florals. These florals are actually on the cover of the student planner as well as these leaves. I'm not exactly sure if there's a name for the student planner, but I know it was kind of an older um, uh, older release so I think it's pretty cool I can make a spread that actually matches the cover of the planner and then we have just the same exact florals just smaller versions of it and then we have these leaves now I think these leaves are in the farmhouse book I believe that's where I saw them last yeah I think these are in the farmhouse book as well as these. I know these for sure are in farmhouse. So I like that they incorporated them in here. The only thing I wish I would have seen, let's see if there any more. Okay, so that's the end of the sticker book. The only thing that I wish I would have seen more in this uh, floral sticker book is more yellow. Because as you're flipping through, you see lots of pinks, uh, lots of blues, lots of reds, purples, and then you get yellows very few and so see so you don't really have much yellow, you have these oranges and then maybe these, these are a little bit more orangey though than yellow. As far as yellow yellow goes, that's really it. These are kind of yellow. That's really all the yellow. I feel like if there would have been more yellow, don't get me wrong, this book is beautiful, but I feel like there's way too much reds and pinks. Um, I feel like if there would have been more like oranges and yellows, it would have been a lot more. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys.